Yeah, all right, here we go. We begin our test. Three quarter ounce fuel. And we get my matches. Where is my matches? <laughs> Very good guy. I think my cat took the matches. I got them. Watch how easy this lights. Cool, cool. Ah, watch how short a time it takes for it to blossom. Usually starts to blossom in 10 seconds or less. Yeah. On with the pot. On with the lid. That's a five and a half inch diameter pot. It's my favorite pot that I use when I go out and do my thing. It has a, a nice coating of creosote on it. I mainly choose to cook and use uh, twigs as my fuel. That's why it's in such a nice coated condition. It holds two cups of water, five inch diameter pot, about approximately two inches tall. I love it. It's my go-to pot. Stove settles down to a nice uh, nice calm flame. It will increase in size as the as the stove heats up. But right now it's it's probably half inch away from the outside edge of the pot. When it's in its full bloom, it'll only go to the edge of the pot. Nothing going up and over the sides. Average time to boil two cups of water with three quarter ounce of heat has been calculated to be six and a half minutes to do two cups of water, three quarter ounce of fuel. Very stable flame, not radical, easy going stove. Blow on it there so you can see that it's, <laughs> it's a it's a motion picture. Most of you know that I was expecting a camcorder for Christmas. Well, I got one, and now I'm, it's my first time to boil in my stovey days. Right. Just starting. Here she goes. Fiberglass inside that wall. This cutaway is just a demonstration of what that fiberglass looks like. In actuality, it gets adhered to the inside wall, and that's what brings the fuel up via capillary action up to the top, and that's what is the reason for a quick evaporation of fuel for a quick startup. Quick startups mean fuel efficiency. Here we go, folks. Lost my fiber.